be a fun day. I'm finally getting to go metal detecting again. Um, but first, we got to go haul a load of junk. Um, the homeowners, um, we've hauled junk for them before, um, but they said we can metal detect if we hauled away their junk. It's kind of a mutual thing, and, and we get to make a few dollars off the junk, so because they don't want it. So right now, I'm headed down Kenny's Road. But you can see they fixed this road. They put some kind of uh, gravel down. It's called Gorilla Gravel. So it's supposed, it's supposed to hold on to the road a lot better. Well, yeah. So anyways, we're almost to Kenny's house. Then we got to transition everything from one truck to the other. And then we're going to head out. So once we get there, we'll see, uh, I'll see that. Hello. Once we get there, um, I'll show you what's going on. And we'll get going. So see you soon. Do some scrap, like I said, and then we're going to uh, do some metal detecting. We're gonna find all kinds of coins today, so hopefully, yeah. So fine. I forgot my pin pointer because I haven't been metal detecting, and I went on a hike and I had to take it off my bag and I left it at the house. So today should be interesting. See how I do without a pin pointer. I'm sure you'll do fine. Yeah. Well, I might be a little out of it because I haven't metal detected in a few. Last time I went was with you when we made the last video of you and I detecting. So but, I ain't been either. It's gonna be fun. Yeah, so. looking forward to it. We'll see you guys in a bit. All right, folks, this is our junk pile, and we've gotten a lot of information on a bunch of good spots to metal detect, and the homeowner wants to come metal detecting with us, which is awesome. So we're gonna get all this junk loaded up. Uh, the homeowner does not want to be on camera, so we're gonna respect their wishes. But we're gonna get this loaded up, and then I'll show you the load when we get up there. All right, guys, I'm sweating like a stuffed pig. Oh yeah. This is the load. First load anyways. Sweet. Oh, hello guys. So we just dropped off at the junkyard, that metal. Um, basically, I wanted to tell you about this place. So I guess back in the day, there was a steamship captain and he would go up and down the river and pick everybody up and bring them back to the Ringwood campground. Um, uh, no, Ringwood Dance Hall, sorry. And where everybody would party all night and everything. Well, they let they changed the dams at one point and the water got deeper. So the place where we're going to metal detect the, the foundation for the dance hall is underwater. So, supposedly, I guess it's not, it's not it's deep enough so we can go out there and metal detect. Um, the guy said he's metal detected before, um, he's used a cheaper metal detector, but he did say he found some 1800s coins and some other cool things. Um, and there's a bunch of other spots. That he would like metal detect too and he's all happy and he's interested in doing it with us so that's gonna be pretty cool the only thing is he doesn't want to be on camera so he's been nice enough to let us detect and all that so i'm not going to put him on camera um maybe he'll warm up and see how i record and not care but you know other than that i'm just going to respect his wishes and not put him on camera uh physically so if he's talking in the background well it's different but all right so we'll see you when we get back there um and we'll do some detecting. All right, this is the trail down. So we got a little ways to go down this trail and then we'll be there. It says it gets a little hairy, so if it does, I'll make sure to record it. All right, guys, this is the old Ringwood campground. Um, down that way, there's a whole bunch more campsites, uh, but this is like the main spot. So somewhere out here, it's probably right here. I don't, I'm not sure. He's, he's, he's on his way down here and he's gonna tell us and then I'll tell you guys, because, like I said, he doesn't want to be on camera. 
um, somewhere in this area somewhere there was a dance hall and it's underwater now so we'll find the foundation eventually um, how old is this well I know um, the captain that owned it was in the 30s during prohibition so he used to have alcohol parties up here so it's at least from the 30s yeah, well, that's what the other guy was saying. Yeah. So, all right, cool. We're going to get familiarized and uh, wait for him to get here, I guess, and then we're going to do some detecting. So we'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys. So I think I found a camping spike for a tent. Yes, sir. I found a zipper pull. Sweet. All right, guys, I found a really, really, really old oil lamp. I'm going to set this on the tailgate for now. Then I'll try to clean it up and show you at the end. Pretty cool. All righty, guys. So we detected here for a little bit, found some coins and just modern coins and uh, bottle caps, stuff like that. But he suggested to take us to a, a spot where he believes there's better finds, uh, older. Uh, so we're gonna go over there. I believe it's the actual dance hall. It wasn't out here. It's over this way So we're gonna go check it out This way, right? See you in a minute All right guys, we're at the secret location Metal detecting around the, th the funny thing is guys is this is the river that I was just fishing in the other day I was just right there in those lily pads fishing where Dave caught the pickle was right up there a little ways. It's pretty crazy. Um, I've gone by this little shack millions of times. So we're gonna get back to detecting. See if we find something good. Well, look at this folks. We got ourselves a top, uh, the wood stove, one of the plates pull out. Pretty cool. Hopefully we're getting older. All right, guys, we got ourselves a button. It's got some writing on it. So it's an older button. Probably off an old pair of Levi's or something. I thought it might look like the Levi's. But it's got writing on the inside. I can't make out yet. Yeah, it's a nice riveted button. I would say Levi's. Oh, a snap button. Yeah. Nice. But it's still it's a little older. Cool. Set that right there. All right, let's get back to it. Next little find, looks like a buck knife. Pretty cool, it's coming up at 36. Sweet. Cool, we're gonna keep going because I know there's some stuff here. So we'll see you in a second. Kenny got himself a penny. Kenny's penny. Let's see what year it is. Shut up, King Boy. <laughs> Wow. Now it's Aaron's penny because he spit on it. Oh. <laughs> I don't want girl germs. 1999. Ooh. Sweet. Girl I germs. I think girl germs would be better than old man germs. <laughs> Keeps calling me a girl all day. All because of the guy at the metal yard trying to spell my name like the girl's way. <laughs> Stop picking on me. But you call me an old man all the time, so. Uh, <laughs> don't never do that. Yeah, right. All right, guys. See you in a minute. All right, guys, look at this. I can barely make it out. It's an old tobacco can. I love it. Oh, nice. Sweet. All right, we found a few cool things. Now we're gonna head back down to the other spot and try that for a little bit longer. Um, I wanna try getting in the water a little bit right at the boat landing thing there. All right. So, it's pretty warm out today. But it's been a pretty good time. Found a few things. All right, guys, we're back down here. Um, we're going to give it a go for another hour or so. And if we don't find anything, we don't find anything. But still fun and you know, a good chance to get to hunt some places that might have some history. So Sweet. Sweet. No, he just talked about me finding a hook. And then look, there it is, right next to the penny. Pretty cool. Beautiful place out here. 
But all right, we gotta get back to it. We have ridges on the edge. It looks the size of a penny. Well, gonna have to wash it. I hope so. Could be old. It, look, it looks the size of a penny. I, I don't know what that is, Kenny, but it's definitely not a penny. It's not a penny? It's definitely not a penny. It's, it's an older coin. It's got... It's got like a reef around the bottom. Really? Maybe it might be a wheat penny. Yeah. It's not, it's not a steel, uh, no, that's something way older. I can't quite make it out, but that's something way older. Come over here in the sun. Yeah. You can see it's not a wheat penny. Oh, that is it not a wheat has penny. A, it has a different design. Wow. Is it Canadian? Ah, oh, I can't turn it, come hand away. Well, see, I sort of feel like I've seen the penny face oh. there, but can't tell man well you turn it just right it does look like a penny face and that looks like the Liberty word right there yeah Maybe. oh it's modern I can see it now it's a modern penny it says something else on it all right we got to figure this out Canadian that wouldn't surprise me that's gonna that needs to go under a microscope or something I yeah, think you turned it just right over here and I saw I thought I saw that building don't scratch it too much like that it was shot it was shot though somebody was like drunk and playing one of those games where you put the penny on the ground shoot it yeah how drunk are you see I can hit a penny yeah I'll put that one aside that's cool though all right we just found ourselves another dime in the same spot. Not what I found. So we got outboarding boating clubs of America. Pretty sweet. Official. It's a tab. Cool. All right, folks, we're digging a 16 just for the hell of it. Found a few. Modern coins here. It's in here. Ah, uh, one of them pull things off in the milk. Well. That's what you get when you dig a 16 with the knock the legend. But you never know. We'll do it. We'll do it again, I'm sure. So we'll see ya. I'm gonna keep hunting. All right, guys. So we hunted around a little bit more. Um, it's getting later in the day. We had to do the junk earlier. But anyways, this is what we found. Um, bunch of change. This is my pile. This is Kenny's right here. Oh, right there. Um, bottle caps. I found, I did find this old tobacco can, which is pretty cool. I just try to clean up, get the name off of it, that's what all it's worth. Uh, this, uh, outboard, oh yeah, outboard boating Club of America tag. And then this, I think, was off in a propane tank off the side of a camper or something. Mm -hmm. Milk tab, it's tent, tent steak at a campsite. So, yep. um, yeah, not just this is pretty cool. This is kind of old found that which made me think I'm in the right area I uh, found this buck knife super cool bunch of garbage in this button that I gotta get looked up oh and then Kenny's we thinking it is a penny now because I think we can see um, Abraham Lincoln right there 
But yeah, it's probably definitely a wheat penny. Yeah, now I'm looking at it, it looks like that's one cent. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? But it's so roached, it's hard to tell. Mm. We'll clean it up with that button. What did I do with it right there? But yeah, that was the finds for today. Down here at Ringwood Camp. I guess that's still the name of it. Yeah, Ringwood Campground. So, it's pretty cool. Um, see you next time. Keep on naturing. Peace.